just here for my Chingford with, with the Green people. I'm here for my family all the way in the Fiji Islands and my family in Pakistan who are suffering the consequences of climate breakdown right now, right now. This is a reality. This is the phone conversations I have with my family around the world. And if you wonder how I became, I'm half Fijian, half Pakistani. My dad met my mom on the run from the police, but that's a whole other story. Um, I want you to do one thing for me right now because I want this to be real to you. I want you to understand why I can't call my auntie in Pakistan right now. She lives in Karachi in Pakistan. We call her flower auntie, Paula Kala, because she's just like a flower. She's just the sweetest woman. And, um, you know, growing up, we used to go to Pakistan anytime we could afford to, every few years. And there was always issues of electricity, there was always issues, uh, the, 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 light, the light would go. But something has happened in the last few years when I, when I go to Karachi, and that is a water shortage. There is a shortage of water happening all around the world right now. And my family can't get clean water. And the only time they can get clean water, because these are the ripple effects already happening because of the climate breakdown, is when they pay gangsters who steal the water further upstream and then sell it back to the poorest people in Karachi, which is where my, where my auntie lives. My flower auntie. that isn't just about us here, that understands our colonial history, our imperial past, the way we behave in the world, and is not going to compromise. We're going to ask for it all. We deserve it all. Thank you so much.